to jacksy.com now with this you get a 33 searches to actually give it a try out see what you think of it but today for an example we'll look up online marketing tools and I'll just show you how I go about uh, finding the the best keywords to add in my articles and things like that so as you can see we obviously <laughs> monthly searches the lower uh, the better but obviously not too low your estimated traffic which is the estimate of if you're at the top top of Google the amount of estimated views you're gonna get visits quoted search results as you can see pages under exact term in Google less than 400 re results mean that there is a very good chance new content can get listed on the first page in Google keyword quality indicator this is basically just telling us um, how much sense your set of key keywords are making um, and this gives you a light obviously green is is good orange is okay and red is poor and we've got the SEO power which I'll show you in a minute anyway so let's go through and click a few of these Right, so it's not really looking very good for that. I'm not seeing many green lights popping up, so let's try it a little bit more long tail. Let's see what it comes up with now. As you can see, it's quite easy to spot which ones you want to be looking at because they're obviously green. So let's have a look. Best online marketing tools 112 monthly searches. On the first page of Google, estimated traffic would be 20 visits per month. SEO power is 85 which means uh, obviously out of 100 85 is pretty good pretty good chances um, marketing tools online again decent 81 SEO marketing tools again um, online marketing research tools 150 monthly estimated searches, 26 visits per month. You may think this is low, but when you've got several different ar articles featuring different keywords, these add up, these soon add up. Best internet marketing tools, 95. So, what I usually do is tick the green ones and obviously the ones that kind of make sense as well take them all save selected then going 
into your keyword lists and here's all your saved keywords what you can also do if you're going to be building a, a niche <coughs> excuse me a niche specific site is you can go and see if the exact keyword domain is available usually you want to be going for dot org or dot com they're a lot easier to rank for so as you can see dot org is available I have to excuse my slow internet connection so this just takes you through to GoDaddy where you can obviously purchase the domain best online marketing tools dot org So, I mean, you could obviously write a an article for each of these list of keywords. So, if you had a an SEO website or um, some f a website that's advertising WordPress plugins or something like that, and you could have an article with you know full of these keywords for each set of keywords. And another good feature of Jaxi is the affiliate programs. Now, put their link on your site, um, and obviously, for every purchase, I think you get uh, forty percent, and it's monthly recurring. So. For every month that that person signed up, you obviously get the, you know, the forty percent. It's a brilliant tool. Um, you can check out your site rank um, if you are within the top twenty pages, I believe it is. Um, you get thirty free searches to test it out. So once you're obviously once your 33 searches have gone, you do have to sign up. I think it's about eighteen dollars per month. But if you can refer a couple of people, that's going to pay for itself. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching.